Hey guys, so here's what's going on. Uh, we're going to do a video on countdowns. And the reason why we're doing a video on countdown is because I think this is a very good thing to have on your website, especially if you're a coach. The reasons behind it are, one, if you're trying to sell a product such as a DVD or a CD series, you want to have a countdown to let people know when it's about to be released. Uh, two, if you're doing, let's say, some sort of seminar or a webinar or some sort of social gathering, you want to have an area where it actually counts it down. Or three, if you have a big book release. All these things are things that you want your, your site goers to know something's going to happen. So if you turn on this feature, what it's going to do is every day somebody goes onto your website, it's going to remind them of something's coming up. Now, my thing is you want to find a really good one, and I found a good one in this one here. It's called Deal or Announcement with Counter Timer. Long name, I know. But what you want to do is download and install it. I'm not going to show you how to do that because we've done this a hundred times already. And after we do that, you're going to come down here. We're going to see Deal with Countdown. So under Deal with Countdown, I've gone ahead and already made one. As you can see, you can include text here at the top. You can also include an image and you can also include a link. So what I'm going to do is click on the edit button just so you can see what it looks like. As you can see right here, post to social, there we go. Um, oh, I'm sorry, but that was on the outside. Okay. So as you can see here, I put the bold tags here, I put the image tag here, I put the HTML stuff here. I know what you think, it's like, whoa, this is nothing that I've seen before as far as doing HTML code. HTML code is pretty simple. If you go to your standard websites um, like uh, Google or Yahoo, you can do a cert common uh, HTML uh, tags as it were and make your own thing. Just experiment with it. That's what I say. But so for example, let's say you have a DVD coming out and you have like the fake DVD box or you know, not the fake DVD box, but a picture of the DVD box. You can always put the DVD box here. You can put the poster for your, for your big, you know, social gathering. You could put the picture of your book, but those things can be put on the website directly with a sign up today link that can take you to a sign in page or take you to the actual website where people can read and see what's going on. I know what you're thinking, like, wow, this seems really, like, hard to do. It really isn't. And if you give it a shot, I'm serious. If you just do a couple quick Google searches on HTML code, you'll be able to do this overnight. I mean, really, it's not that hard. These are just very simple, easy-to-use things. Now, how do we go from this to showing up on your website? It's also easy. Go to Widgets, and then under Widgets, you're going to see, well, I already dropped mine over here, Deal with Countdown. So I'm going to pull it back. And if I pull it back, you're going to see right there, deal with countdown. You're going to grab it, drag it, drop it down, and then you're just going to put whatever information you want here. Save it. And then once you save it, we're going to go back to the website. So let's say this is the website. Let's just go ahead and reload the page, make sure everything comes up fresh. Here you go. Coaches Social. There it is. Sign up today. And if you click it, just imagine like this is a sign up page that you created. Um, this is like if you want people to send you an email or something of that nature. You say, oh, email me or something of that nature. They can all be put right here. It's, like I said, it's very easy, very quick, um, very simple as you've seen. It took less than five minutes to not only configure it, but also get it ready to go. Like I said, guys, there's just limitless things you can do with this. Uh, go ahead and tune in next time. Since we've already done the countdown, we're going to move into the next section which is actually setting up a photo gallery on your website. So hang tight, guys. We're going to do a photo gallery. And after the photo gallery, we've got about maybe two more videos left. And your entire website will be complete. How exciting, huh? Anyways, tune in next time. Photo gallery. Talk to you later.